It has begun. May was a very rainy month, even for our rainforest climate. So good days for outdoor work were few. Then again, in early June, the rainy weather continued, but I was finally able to get the canopy structure up. So I think we'll do a little interview, okay? Oui. Are you game? Oui. Have a sip of coffee. Yeah, have a sip of my decaf. <laughs> sip of my calf. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think you need to move over to be on the camera. No, it's okay. Are you? Yeah, okay. it's good. So what motivates you when, you know, initially we get up and we sort of just get up and then sit down? <laughs> Get up, sit down. I'll take the dog for a walk. Sit down, have a cup of so coffee. So in that case, obviously the dog motivates you, right? You have to because well, the, you dog, have to, yeah. the dog whines at you and yeah. your conscience gets to you. Okay, so that's a, a very tangible motivation. But when there's jobs that, well, you know, people may or may not care about or know about, but you know in your mind it's part of your ethic that you want to do that. What motivates you? So for instance, you're, you were, now, what is, what needs doing today in your department? In my department? I have to, yeah, I have to put the noggins up and, and, uh, and put the, uh, fascia boards on and, and put the, uh, uh, and we're putting a ceiling on the... Yeah, on the, on the underside. So what we're talking about is the canopy. And we haven't posted a lot about the ongoing renos here. So we had a big snowstorm in... Was it 2022? 2022, yeah. Yeah, and it was so heavy that it took down the canopy over our back. Yep, in one soggy, heavy snowfall, we lost the entire cover over our back porch. And in this rainy climate, you want your porch covered. manufactured home we have two entries which is really nice to have we have one which is considered a front door we rarely use I think Amazon's the only one who uses yeah. it but it's a nice little patio for a we have a barbecue and table and chairs that's and the, a nice place to sit yeah yeah and we we like to hang plants and that there so our what is our back door is commonly is we use as our main entryway and it had a very large cover on it and that the snow brought it all down. Was it aluminum? Yeah, it's aluminum. Yeah. So now over the past year Paul has first repaired the shed because the canopy the porch was attached to the shed and we wanted a peaked roof rather than flat and a new roof in metal. So Paul has done a great deal of work this year on that. Wow, it's so cold this morning and now the deck is burning my feet. Paul is coming right along with our canopy for our back porch deck. Whoa, but it's hot on the feet. And the bare feet. Okay, so back to you needing to put the ceiling on. Yeah, so I have to put the ceiling on. 
Oh, put some eavesdrops on the canopy and... He's already got the eavesdrops just newly on the shed, but they, yeah. the leaks need to be... They've got to fix the leaks, yes, yeah. And we're gonna gotta paint the deck. Yeah. So anyways, the order of the day today is first of all, I think we better go get the sheet, the ceiling panels, the sheeting, right? Uh, no, I wanna put the, put the, I wanna put the canopy up or put the... That's up. <laughs> no, the noggins in. Uh, and are you gonna use your nail gun for that? Yeah. Oh good, I like the nail gun. <laughs> I'm always asking Paul, when are you gonna use, we recently got a, a nail gun, so. So that's your chores today. And, for um, today, yes. For today. And you're motivated by... Has to get done. <laughs> no, but is there, do you ever, like for me, I always hold myself a little, if I finish this, I can do that. Do, do any of you do that? Put a comment. And So do you have that, like, you, I know you were looking at yeah. camping places yesterday. Yeah, I was looking at camping places yesterday and uh, looking for a free one. Or but, we can buy a lake somewhere. We so can does the mo yeah. so does the finishing your chore get motivated by the yeah. thought of when that's yeah. done we can do this? Yeah. Yeah, we do. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, we'll get on with our chores, and I need to get motivated to um, clean up junk, <laughs> tables, and like, oh, find places to put things. That's always a dilemma in a small home. Is where do you put things? I mean, we can't complain because we're fortunate to have lots, but, Make and I have, it's Monday, laundry. I like to keep on top of that. So if I get a load today, it won't pile up. Yeah. Okay, well, shall we toast our day? Yep, <laughs> my coffee here. Have a good to one. To a well-motivated and uh, uh, to a lot of progress. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Oh, that end, yeah, but this end, if you push this end to the right. Perfecto. The noggins are going in. And where do you put the nail? Hands. What do you mean? Like they have to go in at an angle? No, they go straight in this one and an angle in the back. They go where? Straight in here. And then you go oh, from oh, 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 duh! So as you do each one, you have to put because oh, I I thought you were just putting that in with the mm. nails and <laughs> okay, I get it. I really don't know much about construction, so a nail goes in there, mm. two one each because it's four inches wide, so two nails, and then you tone it. Mm. Does one go in at an angle? In the, at the back. Oh, I see. One end you do, because you've already put the nail into that other one. Yeah. And, and so put, then. Put it onto this one. Then. Oh, of course. The only way you can do that is to put a watch.
do with your noggins today? What? Almost mostly done. straight. How many did you get? How many? You start the boat here? And all the way down. 16 and how you've got one, two, four to go. Wonderful. Got to put the dryer on. It's the most annoying thing when you have a load all done and then you forget to turn on the dryer. Dark load done, white still to be. On camera. <laughs> and my washing machine is done. This isn't attached, is it? <laughs> I've already had one major lifetime fall from leaning over. I can't reach it. Too bad. You let me have to move your stepmother. Maybe I can from this because I might know I can't. Why can I reach it? It reminds me of me. This is, whoops. Those are interesting. I don't know if I've ever seen that kind of Self tapping. Oh, I've heard of a self tapping scoop. So that's what that is. And exactly what self tapping means. <laughs> that means you don't have to put a bolt on the end. No, it goes from there. This is back here. No reaching for that hammer when there's a. Uh, a, a thing here, but it's not attached. I did that one time when I was 35 or 34 or something, my early 30s, and I fell 14 feet. Uh, 
was reaching to hang clothes and there had been a temporary uh, fence put in where my clothes land was. And then I leaned up and lost my balance and I fell all the way down to a cement sidewalk 14 feet below. And I was on my feet. Good job, you didn't break your feet. Oh, I know. I can't believe I didn't break my feet. But my, um, I'm sure I, it impacted my, verte my vertebrae or my discs. And my, yeah, like that uh, guy, Montana Haven, broke yeah. both his heels. Yeah, I, was, I, I guess I had shoes on, I can't remember. I just remember being in the hospital and my first husband came in and told, asked me why I was trying to parachute without a parachute. <laughs> he thought it would be good to make me laugh. Today, isn't it? Um, I needed you to open the package on the ground beef. I can't pull that back. My thumb. Yeah. We call that the grumpy groan. <laughs> he's not a grumpy grumpy, but he's a groaning grumpy. <laughs> Swept and cleaned all underneath the sink because it's one place that gets so dirty. Look anything like the chefs on TV when I make dinner. <laughs> All tastes good though.
テーブル設定の。Patty is getting sirloin tip. Crown beef. He didn't eat much of his food yesterday. Remember, Patty's an old dog and he has congestive heart failure. Oh, there you go. Eat hearty, little guy. No, you want water? Well, I've got water for you. Too. After all, Patty. Oh, man, he's going for that beef. <laughs> you like that, don't you? You didn't eat all day because you had kibbles. Now you've got. Patty's going through so much water lately. Part of his old age, I guess. And he has a terrible cough. He's a good dog. He's very lean, so I'm adding, adding some butter. To the gravy, and I'm gonna make a buttery, thick gravy.、And、we don't usually have it because we try to avoid carbohydrates. I am going to put some flour in some cold water, and like this much flour, put in some cold water, and then add it to the gravy, and that should be it. Dinner's ready. So a couple of tablespoons of flour. No, one tablespoon of flour in a. Uh, about、oh, more than a tablespoon of, of water.、I'll、turn my heat up on the thing. I'll turn the heat back down again.、I、didn't have any beef broth on hand, but. Simmering this at a real low temperature and put a little more hot sauce in. It's a quick solution, an alternative to hamburgers for dinner. 